My fashion has grown and developed and changed so much over the years. However, I've definitely got to a stage in my life where I'm about quality over quantity. And I've got to a stage in my life where I absolutely love color matching. I am very much a monochrome and neutrals girl. So what I thought I would do today is basically go through the staple pieces that are in my wardrobe year in, year out, seasons, across occasions, wherever I'm going, whatever I'm doing, because I'm definitely moving into the space of creating a capsule wardrobe and culling everything out of my wardrobe that doesn't fit in that space. I hope that you're looking forward to today's video. If you are, please do give me a like, hit that subscribe button and leave any comments down below. But without further ado, let's get on with the video. First things first, I'm gonna start with my coats and jackets because they are the pieces that make up my autumn winter capsule wardrobe every single year. I always love the out kind of idea of layering. So my coat is the main piece. Um, my favorite coat, in my wardrobe has to be this black long line oversized coat from Zara. It has a double breasted fit with pockets at the front and you have this really nice button detailing too. This coat comes back in stock every single year and it's probably the best thing I've ever bought for my wardrobe. I wear it genuinely in the autumn winter like every other day. The thing I usually do is I'll wear a very monochrome outfit underneath. I'll even style it with the bow and tee that I have on now. I love combining smart with casual. So I love wearing active wear with a nice smart coat over the top. This coat could be worn with trainers, with boots, with heels. It's a really interchangeable piece and it works so, so well. What I tend to say is with coats, I like to go for those core colors. So I like black, I like creams and beige, I like gray, um, and I like things that will really go with all of the kind of under colors that I have within my wardrobe. Next up, I will show you the camel version of that coat. Now, this is my other favorite piece in my wardrobe. She comes out all of the time. She actually comes out very much before the black version purely because of the color. This coat fits incredibly, incredibly well, and it's such a gorgeous camel. It's got these really nice buttons at the front, again, double-breasted, really nice lapel, and then you don't have any button detailing on the cuff, but it's just a really gorgeous oversized fit. The best thing about these coats as well is they are wool so they do keep you nice and cozy next up i have quite a new item in my wardrobe but i have been looking for the perfect puffer for quite a while this is a beautiful long puffer coat she is ankle length and honestly incredible this puffer coat is super super cozy but it's so stylish as well you have really nice deep pockets at the front. You have the detail at the sleeve with a thumb hole. You have the vents at the bottom and this piece honestly will be in my wardrobe for years. It is such a staple piece in your wardrobe and I absolutely love this. It doesn't come in any colors, but I think the black is perfect when you are trying to create that capsule wardrobe feel for yourself. I think something really important to recognize about a capsule wardrobe, it is not all about having basic pieces. That's not the point. It's absolutely okay to have those pieces. They're a little bit more of a statement, have some character. This piece is brand spanking new, but she is gonna be in my wardrobe for years. I just know it. This piece is stunning. She has the combination of the cream with the black and this really beautiful balloon sleeve with the double cuff at the bottom. What I love about this piece is it combines three of my favorite things. So you've got the black, the cream, and then you have the silver detailing, which is really important for me because I wear silver jewelry. So it combines all of those three things and makes it incredibly interchangeable. This piece could be styled with the outfit I have on now. It could be styled with a jogger set. It could be styled with leather trousers if you want to go kind of out there or just jeans as well. I think this piece is the perfect piece to have if you want to be a little bit dressier on your day out or if you're going out on a night out too. One thing I absolutely love is a two-piece and I have got the most beautiful 
black two-piece in my wardrobe. It's this gorgeous jacket and it has the matching skirt as well. Now this is relatively new in my wardrobe. However, I've always had a black two-piece in my wardrobe. I find them so easy to style. Whack on a pair of tights and a chunky pair of boots and you've got a really nice daytime outfit. Or you could go legs out with some heeled boots or legs out with some heels. It's a really interchangeable piece. Again, absolutely love this. I think it's so beautiful. You could pop a jumper underneath or you could wear it without and it just really, really works. The other thing is you can layer it. So you could actually pop the camel coat over your shoulders just to add another color. Imagine that with some matching knee-high boots or even treat yourself to something that's more of a statement. Get some snake skin boots, whack them on, and you've got the most beautiful outfit and all you've done is added a layer to the top of what you already had. So as you saw, we had the jacket there. Now we have the matching skirt. Again, a very interchangeable piece. You could wear it as a two-piece or simply pop on an oversized jumper with this, tuck in the front, pop your jacket over the top and you have a new outfit. Pop on some chunky boots or even wear it with heel boots and you have a really, really gorgeous transitional outfit that could be worn all the way through the autumn winter season. So next up, I have potentially one of my favorite pieces in my wardrobe because it is the coziest thing ever and I literally wear it all the time. This is my House of CB jogger set. I have the hoodie and then I also have the matching joggers. Honestly, this piece is so, so versatile. Now, I'm not gonna lie, I'd always wear it as a two-piece, but dress it up by putting on a camel coat on top and dress it down if you wanna put a puffer on. I always pair this with a pair of white trainers and I just think having a jogger set in your wardrobe for me is an essential. Like, I would wear this if I'm just popping out for a walk or going to the shop or if I'm even going for a day out in London, like I actually think this is quite a nice look. If I'm going out for Sunday lunch or something, I'd wear my jogger set. I also think this is the perfect airport outfit. Honestly, this was such a good thing to buy. It cost 130 pounds for the two and it might sound ridiculous to spend that much on a jogger set, but I'm so glad I did because it's so, so comfy and cozy and I will have this in my wardrobe forever. Next up, I have my faithful leggings from Top Shop. These are the leather look leggings and they come out every single year. Thank goodness that when ASOS took over Top Shop, they continued to make these leggings because they are elite. I've tried so many. I've tried them from Zara. I've tried them from River Island. I've tried them from Mango. None will ever beat the Top Shop leggings. I really like these. They are so easy to style. They have a nice zip detailing as well, which makes them really comfortable. And they're so elasticated that you can go out for a really nice big meal and still be feeling fine afterwards. Next up, I have a pair of jeans. Now these are the Orson jean from Topshop. I say that they are most similar to a slim leg mom jean. These are in a really, really nice wash black color with silver detailing and they also have a raw hem at the bottom. I have a feeling that they don't make the Orson jean anymore, but if they did, I would get them again because they are so, so comfy. They fit really, really well around the hips and the waist, and they also fit well in the leg. They're so comfy. They go really well with boots and heels and trainers, and I love the fact that they're cut off at the bottom because I'm. they create more of a seamless transition into your footwear. Finally, for the bottoms, I have a pair of leather shorts Shorts. Leather shorts are a go-to in the winter for me. I love styling with them with tights and an oversized jumper and boots or even with heels and a blazer. I think that they work so, so well. This pair are a faux leather pair, again, from Topshop. I don't think they make this style anymore because I got them about three years ago, but I'm sure you can find something very, very similar. I like the fact that they come with a belt, but then again, you could absolutely change the belt to something slightly more dressy, should you wish. These would be so, so gorgeous with an oversized jumper and chunky boots and a nice oversized coat as well. I really, really, really love these. 
Next up, we have the absolute staple that is a white bodysuit. This one is from Stradivarius. I believe they are much better quality than the Zara ones because they are double lined all the way through. This is a staple in my wardrobe. I wear it all the time, whether that be on its own or under a jumper for layering. It just is a necessity. I love this piece so much. I chose the white one. I could have chosen the black because it really is a toss up between the two, but this is definitely one that I highly recommend having in your wardrobe. Next up, I have a really, really nice, cozy knit gray jumper from Topshop. This is something that comes out in my wardrobe every single year. I love adding an element of gray to my outfits. I don't have much gray, but this is the perfect piece. I love styling it with leather trousers, with leather shorts. I like wearing it with jeans. I think it goes really well with a numerous amount of coats. And you can also style it with, you know, trainers, boots, anything you wear this is so gorgeous I love a big chunky collar I'm a huge fan of a chunky funnel neck and I think this jumper is such a staple piece in my wardrobe it is fairly old so it definitely won't be available anymore but I will see if I can find something similar for you and tag it down below Finally, in the jumper section, I have one of the best things I've ever bought from Zara. This is a really gorgeous jumper from Zara. It's a really nice white color with this lovely ribbed detailing and it has the most beautiful funnel neck at the top. You have really long sleeves with a slit detail. And then as you will see, you also have that at the side. What I like about this jumper is the front is slightly shorter than the back so it has that natural kind of figure style for you you can wear this with anything and i just think it is the perfect piece to have in your wardrobe again this will definitely be out of stock because i've had it for about four years but i will definitely find something similar and tag it down below for you next up we will move on to handbags now i have two handbags which i've had in my wardrobe for a long time and i will continue to use them for a long time we all know my furla handbag she is my girl i I love her so so much i've recently upgraded to the mimi handbag i used to have a different one but it's slightly worn down now this mimi handbag is absolutely stunning and it has a really nice double chain as you can see you can lower it and have it on your shoulder but you can also have it crossbody as well. This bag is the perfect size. It's perfect for daytime and nighttime. I can fit so much in here. It's like a TARDIS. Second up is my nude furla handbag. I've had this handbag for many, many years and I find it is the perfect piece to have. It's beautiful because it creates a lighter feel to your outfits. And I think having a cream handbag and a black handbag is perfect. Again, it has the double chain detail so you can wear it crossbody or on your shoulder. These handbags retail at around £450, but we have got a store in Bista Village where they do a high discount on handbags too. Moving on to footwear, I will start with this gorgeous pair of boots from And Other Stories. Now, I spoke about these in one of my recent hauls and I still absolutely love them. The best thing about these boots is they are so, so tight at the top. They fit so well. They're just a beautiful boot all around and I highly recommend everyone investing in a nice pair of chunky boots for the winter months. I personally don't suit Dr. Martens, so this is a really good alternative for me and I just find them so, so gorgeous and so comfy and they will be styled with so many of the outfits that I've shown you today. Next up, we have a leather sock boot. Sock boots are my favorite thing in the world. I have quite a few pairs, I will be honest. So I'm actually looking to invest in a more expensive pair at the moment. I've seen some really nice ones on Balenciaga and I think Le Bouton do some too. I pay about 30 pound a pair at the moment and I do think they just don't last very long. I wear them every day, literally every day. If I'm going out shopping or whatever, I wear them all the time. So I think it's time to invest. What I like about this pair if they have a really nice square toe at the front and they are really figure hugging at the top as well they are a beautiful pair of boots to have in your wardrobe and they create such a nice silhouette if you have leather trousers on too next up we have another favorite purchase of this year my gorgeous new balance 327s i am obsessed with this pair of trainers. I wear them so, so often. I think they're so versatile and the 327s sell out so quickly. They are literally like 
gold dust so keep an eye out because they do come back in stock but they fly off the shelves these are the perfect pair of trainers to have in your wardrobe i also have them in black but i personally prefer the white i think they go with a lot more and they just create balance when you have quite a dark outfit and then you have the white and the cream at the bottom it creates the perfect contrast finally today i have picked out a pair of heels now i am very much an open toe heel with a barely there strap these are from ego and they're a really nice black pair of stilettos really gorgeous double strap but you can hardly see them on your foot i think these are a really gorgeous pair of heels to have in your wardrobe that brings me to the end of my auto winter capsule wardrobe i hope that you've really enjoyed this video i think this is quite an interesting one because it really makes you think about the pieces that you buy and the pieces that you wear um i've really enjoyed creating this it's definitely made me think differently if you have enjoyed this video and you would like to see more then please do not forget to hit that subscribe button give me a like and leave any comments down below also feel free to follow me on instagram at isla Catherine. i post much more content on there as well have a beautiful week and i will see you very soon in my next video